Hi everyone, this is Srinivas from Amir Pet Technologies. In this video, I am going to explain how to check the given number is Armstrong number or not. See, first of all, we need to understand what is Armstrong number. In this video, I am going to explain about only the three digit number is Armstrong number or not. First, so what is Armstrong number? Suppose if they have given one number, how many digits are there? Three digits are there. So, we need to find out each digit cube. 3 cube, I mean power 3, is 5 power 3 and is 1 power 3. Each digit, each digit, right? Power, total number of digits count we need to find out. So, here total three digits are there. So, every individual digit cube we are finding. So, 1 cube is 1. 5 cube is 125, here it is a 3 cube is a 27, the total value we are getting is 153. So if the final sum value is equals to the given number, then simply we can say that it's an Armstrong number. Sir, suppose if there are only two digits, then we need to find out each digit square, power 2. If there is only one digit, then we need to find out power 1 is equals to the same digit. But with the two digits or with the four digits Armstrong number that we will see in the next video. But in this video, I am explaining only the three digit number is Armstrong number or not. So how to write? We know that it is simple. First, I am taking the number is 153 and then just we are taking that sum value is 0 some value is 0 and now each digit we are considering until that n value is 0 becomes 0 just we are considering that each digit how you will get the last digit we know that integer that digit is equals to n mod 10 it will give you the last digit ok after getting the last digit right what we need to find out we need to cube it so, D is multiplied with a D is multiplied with a D. It will give you the cube value of the digit. Then that is adding to the sum. Sum plus. Then store into this sum. Sum equals to sum plus. See, first you will get the digit is 3. So, D contains 3. So, 3 into 3 into 3. That 3 cube we are finding the 27 that you are adding to the sum finding that you are adding to the sum after working with that just remove that digit right how to remove that n equals to n by 10 it will remove the last digit then again loop will repeat again loop will repeat see one thing you need to understand first n value is 153 next after removing the last digit it will become 15 Right after removing the last digit, it will become 1. After removing this digit, it will become 0. Finally, n value becomes 0. So then how can we compare the n value and the sum value both are equal? Suppose, if you write, if the given number equals to this sum, it never equals because always, finally, n value becomes 0. So you cannot compare the n value with any other number. You cannot compare. So then how to do it? It is very simple. So if n is equals to some value, directly suppose if you print it is an Armstrong number, Armstrong number, else, else if you are printing it is not an Armstrong number, always you will get the result is not an Armstrong number, not an Armstrong number. Because n value always you make it zero. Then what I should do? Simple. Here, before modifying the n value, just take that n value into other variable, x. Now, x value is 153. Then you can modify, no issues. Okay, n value becomes 0, but still x value is 153 only. So, you please compare this x with sum. If both are equal, then you can say that it is an Armstrong number. Okay, so what is Armstrong number? Simple each digit power by how many digits are there their sum 
is equals to the given number that is called Armstrong number. Hope you understood. Please practice the code. Thank you.